Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Solinux Crypto. Hope you're all doing great and welcome to uh, your daily update on WSM, the WSM token, Wall Street memes, pre-sale, whatever you want to call it. We'll be doing a new update on it. Um, we'll purely look at the technicals. There, uh, sometimes we'll blend in and we'll mix in some fundamentals that are important or that mean anything for, for WSM. Uh, but in general, we'll focus on the technicals. That's what we've been doing for the last two, three days and it has turned out all right, or at least in terms of uh, predictability what we've seen is that wsm very clearly started a strong downtrend on saturday and that resulted in dropping down to this major support between 4.5 and 4.3 but then we already said that once it got to that level if it doesn't find strong support there and this i mean this is all in my videos right so i, I cannot lie about this um but what i said is that if from there it doesn't break above 4.7 or 4.8 cents so regains that bullish momentum, it will likely drop down lower uh, and it dropped down even lower than what I expected. I expected it to find some support between like 3.8 and 4 cents due to the psychological uh, support of 4 cents. Uh, but it didn't. It dropped down uh, immediately down towards this level right here between 3.5 and 3.7 cents. And that is where we are right now. And still WSM is not showing that much momentum. Uh, so that's what we'll talk about in this video before we do that though i quickly want to t tell you something about my premium if you're not interested just skip ahead 10 seconds or something uh, but i have my own premium group in which i share my own trades and i'm a profitable trader and the results are also transparent but there's also you really become a better trader so if you're interested in that there's a lot of tips tricks there's a chat room full of traders which you can learn from uh, consider joining links will be down in the description now to wsm so WSM right now, when looking at it, like the volume is still super high. So in general, I would say that there's still a lot of momentum within WSM. The momentum right now, though, like the open interest also still growing. Like the, if, if you take a look at this, you would actually say that th these are great numbers. It actually looks good. And you would say that a coin is bullish if you see these numbers, because it, it's being traded more and more, at least the perpetual futures. But usually that's a good indication of price and more positions are open um so volatility is expected for wsm but then you take a look at the technicals and it just looks so so bearish <laughs> all right so the situation is a bit difficult because what this could also mean is that we're going to get, get a huge crash because these open positions a part of them is short a part of them is long and if the price drops down a bit all of those long positions will either be be closed which means the price drops down further or which or will be liquidated which also means the price will drop down further so we need something that that you know pushes the price up and right now in terms of uh fundamentals there's nothing because the buyback they say the buyback is completed on october the 11th if that's completed, that means that buying pressure has dropped down because they, they you know, it's a buyback program. So that increases buying pressure, uh, which means that there's less support holding up the price, which is bearish. All right. So I think we need to in the next 24 hours, while there's still a chance, while WSM technically still has momentum, it needs to break above this level right here at four cents. If it's able to break above that, well, first of all, because of the open interest, there's a chance of a rally. I wouldn't say that's the most likely scenario but then second of all also we at least like there's a chance of a rally and at least wsm will stabilize all right so that is the key thing that needs to happen right now and just purely technically if wsm is not able to break above that level and no other bu bullish fundamental news comes out so we only have the buybacks stopping it's just most likely that it will drop down below 3.5 cents as well with with all the effects that that will have I'd say it dropped down to three cents, so below the listing price or the opening price. Um, but who knows? Then the, the then the situation becomes even more bearish. And I would say, um, just purely because there's no indication right now that the that the technical structure is breaking, I would say this is the most likely scenario, unfortunately. So we'll have to see. I still have my hopes up high for a bullish breakout above four cents, like I said, which would give us a chance of a rally. I'll try to cover that as soon as possible then, but at least it would solidify some stability in the price of WSM. But if that doesn't happen, that's bad news. All right. So that's my take on WSM, unfortunately. If you do have any questions, anything, let me know down in the comments. But for now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.